Chef, you have been tasked with having me introduce my show. Come on, man. Here you go. Yes, but that's a free gift from the Gong Shell Man. The Great Street. You got it. You got that right, man. But this is really, boy? <laughs> now I'm making the Kong shell horn. The horn, the shell is made of the sand. You can look and you can see the sand that's drop off. Tell me why you waiting. Gotta seize the moment. Ain't no promise for tomorrow. Gonna let him hear the motto. It's a trick. Is the voice. I'm knocking it out right now. If I don't take out this little piece, don't care what I do, it wouldn't blow. This is it right here. That's the voice. You have to take it out, else the conch shell wouldn't blow. Simple as that right here. That make the conch shell blow. If you take it out right, it blow. If you don't take it out right, it don't blow. That's the voice of the shell. That's the voice. That's the voice of the shell right there. If you crack in there, the conch shell wouldn't blow. That's the horn. That's you the just, horn. You just, you just fix your lip around that properly and then just blow it. Form your lips like you're spitting and you got your horn. The smaller your mouth is, the more better you can blow it. It's puckering your mouth. If you blow like I'm blowing up alone, it won't blow. It won't make the sound. You have to pucker and blow. My name is Monique, but everybody calls me Nikki. Alright. Alright? So this is a family business you're It's a family business. You don't make all these stuff? Most of them we make ourselves. Oh, all handmade. Nice. We dive the shells, so we clean the shells ourselves. When we don't dive, we get them from the uh, corner ski dog, where we do all the cleaning and scrubbing ourselves. We make the horn ourselves. Some of the shells be hard, some be soft. Like this one here, this is a bit a little hard, but getting ready to open it so you can feel the softness of it now. So yeah, you can see the sun. The conch shell is made from sun. See the sun? The sun just drop off. The smaller your motors, the more better you can blow them. Now I'm getting ready to take out the whites. Without this, if this isn't out, it wouldn't blow. That right there. Huh? That, that right there. That's the horn. You got it? Got it. So how much of these tongue shell on you to make it in a day? Well, it all depends. It all depends. Some days 40, some days 50, some days 100. It all depends. How much one of these go for? How you sell them? I sell them, I, I, I sell them for... I sell some for ten, I sell some for five, I sell some for ten. Small set for five, big set for ten. Right now, it's going to sign and down the lip? The lip. To make sure when you go to blow it, you don't get cut. But the tongue shell are very sharp. Yeah, sand, made from sand. I know you got a lot of tongue shells there. You dive these up yourself or you have a bunch of them. No, me and my children. This is a family business, me and my children. That's excellent. It's how I feed the conch shell, it's how I feed all of my children. I feed all my children from baby off of years. Now the youngest one 18 and the oldest one 26. All them can blow horns. Even my grandchildren can blow this. I got two granddads, they can blow these too. This one that I'm doing, that's one for you. It's your souvenir. Fix this one up good for you. Where you can fix it, you can learn to blow. You can, if a woman can blow it, I show you can learn to blow that yourself. I appreciate the souvenir. I can learn how to blow it today. Yeah. I think I got a little clue though. Okay. The same way you, the same way you form your lips like you spitting. Yeah. It's the same way you. Most days 
because he thinks of the ship. I thought it was a ship on. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs>